What is up everyone? Welcome to another brand new video. Super excited about this video today. I wasn't expecting to receive this package until Monday and lo and behold, it showed up today and I could not wait to get into this. This is going to be the Walk Off Wax Mega Blaster. Uh, I've seen these opened on multiple channels, including jabs and uh, each and every one seems to be awesome. So I'm excited to crack into this. This is Searching for Hits with Eric and I am Eric. And uh, I was a winner as soon as I opened the shipping box because there was an extra pack in there. Uh, 1995 Top Series 1, which is awesome. <clears throat> they guarantee you <clears throat> nine packs inside, uh, six current packs, three wax classic packs, and then you get two guaranteed hits or one graded star or rookie. So without further ado, let's get into this. I am so excited. Let me get this cellophane off. I'm hoping I'm gonna have the same luck that, uh, that everyone else that I've seen open these has had. So inside, love this packaging too. Um, inside, there is our guaranteed hits. Uh, we'll save that for last. Love how they seal those, that's really cool. And we'll get into our packs. Um, as usual, we have some sleeves. We also have some hard top loaders for all those hits. Hopefully we'll have lots of them. There's our 95. Put that aside right there. So let's see what we have, we have. Whoa, we have Topps Chrome Sapphire Edition. That's a Topps uh, website exclusive. I've never opened these before. That is going to be cool. Uh, we have, what is, what year is this? 2007 Bowman Chrome Hobby Pack. Very cool. <clears throat> we have a Donruss. That's an 89 Donruss. So we'll be looking for your Ken Griffey Jr. rookie card. We got a 94 Upper Deck Western Region. Uh, don't know if I ever opened those. We have a Big League 2020. Like that said a lot. That was a lot of fun. I've opened up a bunch of those. We got a 2020 Heritage. Nice set right there. We got a Diamond Kings from 2019. And we have a 2020 Series 1 Jumbo Pack. So lots of really great stuff to open up. <coughs> Excuse me, I don't even know where to start. Um, I guess we'll go in, uh, let's open them up in, in order of, of when they came out, I guess. So let's start with those, and then we'll move on to the 277. There's a 19, and then we'll get into the 2020 stuff. We'll save that sapphire for last. That's gonna be fun. All right, so that'll be the order we're gonna open them in. Looking for all kinds of big hits. Um, let's see what we can find. We'll start off with the 89 Donruss. Um, love this set. Looking for the Griffey Jr. Randy Johnson, rookie. Let's see what we can find. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Hit the alerts so you know when I'm posting. Um, didn't post for a, almost a week, and then uh, lo and behold, we were able to get two videos in two days. So let's see what we can find. Uh, leading off is going to be a Doc Gooden. Um, the packs, unfortunately. The bottom here is fringed, the first few cards at least. Um, looks like a miscut, but it's okay. You got Jim Gantner. This is what the back of the cards look like. Donruss from this year gave you the previous five-year stats, plus the career. We got Mike Krukow, Sid Bream, Jimmy Jones, Paul Molitor, MVP card, Glenn Davis, Terry Pendleton, Chuck Finley. Got a Diamond King of Robin Yount, who's a Hall of Famer. B.J. Serhoff, Dave Schmidt, Chet Lemon, Tim Belcher, Neil Allen, and Corey Snyder. So 
Nothing in our first pack to get too excited about, but that is okay. We have plenty of other things to open. So let's get into this 1994 Upper Deck. Uh, 12 cards per pack. Diamond Insert Cards, as well as Trade Upper Deck Heroes Insert Cards. Um, don't know if I've ever opened this one. That's what the, the odds are for this product. So let's we'll see what we can find. 1994 Upper Deck. Looks like they're in all different directions. That's what the uh, <clears throat> the cards look like right here. Got a home field advantage card of Ripken Jr. That's an insert card. It's pretty cool. No, it's not an insert card. Cards are sticking together a little bit. We got a Derek Lee top prospects card. It's pretty cool. Derek Lee had a nice career. Thought he came up with the. Marlins. Didn't realize he was a Padres prospect. We got a Ryan Hancock top prospects card. Kind of looks like a foil card a little bit. Uh, there is an electric diamond card of Stan Javier. Uh, electric diamond insert card. It's pretty cool. Uh, Greg McMichael. Steve Finley. Got a Sammy Sosa. Sosa from his early days with the Cubs. Pretty cool card. Got a Ken Caminiti. Got the big hurt, Frank Thomas. Put Frank Thomas on the screen. I always love Frank Thomas. Got John Cruck running down a pop-up. And uh, Chris Sabo towards the end of his career. And Mel Rojas. So a couple of nice cards in there. I like that design. That's what the back of the cards look like, by the way. Uh, pretty cool. Pretty cool cards. I've never opened up the uh, 94 Upper Deck. So, put that diamond insert card up there, too, just for now. But, uh, pretty cool. So, let's open up our bonus pack that came outside of the walk-off wax box. They were nice enough to give me a 95 Top Series 1 pack. I can get this little team bag open that they put it in. Okay. Look at that. They give you a little offer. Five free packs with another order. So, I'll save that. And, uh, we'll see if I order another box. We'll get some free packs. That's what the packaging looks like for the 95 tops. So let's crack on in and see what we got. Hope everyone's having a great start to their weekend. Um, I know I am finding this outside my doorstep this morning, so um, glad I was able to share this with everyone today. Um, these cards are kind of sticky, so we'll do just a little bit of a little bit of flex to try to separate them. Uh, that's what the 95 Tops cards look like. There's Dante Bichette, father of Bo Bichette. That's what the back of the cards look like right there. Uh, pretty standard uh, stat line. Tops gives you a lot of stats. Got the nice headshot and action photo on the back. Uh, there is Jeff Brantley. Up next is going to be Dave Magadan, post-New York Mets. Loved him when he was with the Mets. We got <clears throat> Paul Sorrento. We got my my son Nathan, who's walking in. I know he wanted to be a uh, be a part of the video and uh, and help me out a little bit, so he's he's standing next to me now. We got a Doug Drabeck. We got Delino DeShields. Let my son pull up a seat there. Say hi, I Nathan. Hi. I don't know what I missed. You didn't miss much yet, so we're just opening up these packs here from this walk-off wax box. And uh, yeah, hang out, let's see what we got here. 
We got Paul Wagner. The card took some damage sticking together. That's always fun. Brett Main. We got a draft pick card of Ramon Castro, but these cards are in terrible shape. Um, 1994 Tops All Star card of Jimmy Key and was that Danny Jackson? Um, again, these cards are in terrible shape. Oh, look at this. That's a nice card. And I'll strike out leader Pedro Martinez from his first year in the big leagues. Or second year. Um, that's pretty cool. We'll put that up on screen. We got a Bill Pulsifer. Bill Pulsifer was supposed to be a fantastic prospect pitcher for the Mets. Didn't really pan out. Did you get one of those special boxes? One of those special boxes that we got in the last pack? No, this is different. Here, sit down. <laughs> uh, we got an insert. What is this? This is a uh, cyber stats card of Dave Winfield. That's pretty cool. I know my cousin Joe is going to love seeing that. In fact, I'll put that aside for him. He's a huge Dave Winfield fan. Uh, Melvin Nieves and Billy Spires. So, Nathan, if you could actually put this in. Uh, nope, you're eating a cupcake. We don't want to get cupcake on the cards. <laughs> So Sorry. we'll put that in a sleeve. Yeah, I'll, I'll do it after I eat this cupcake. <laughs> My sister made cupcakes last sister night. Sister made cupcakes, and he's having a cupcake for breakfast. That's great. Mm -hmm. All right, <laughs> next up is going to be a 2007 Bowman Chrome Pack. Uh, Ten Ooh. cards per pack. There's what the packaging looks like. Really difficult to see. Um... Now we're getting into the more modern stuff, so all kinds of inserts, numbered card possibilities, autographs. We'll see what's in here, but um, again, this is a walk-off wax Mega Blaster. You can check this out on their website. Um, they were back-ordered. I tried to get this for a few weeks and finally was able to get it. Um, really cool product. I'm really digging the walk-off wax product. I get this pack open. This pack is fighting back. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's see what is in this pack. I like that design a lot. These 2007 Bowman. Um, was it Bowman Chrome? Oh, it's a it, it's a 2007 Bowman Hobby Pack with two Chrome cards in every pack. Um, I'm gonna be right back. I was a little confused there because Bowman Chrome typically only comes with four or five cards. So let's see what we got here. Scott Olson. That's what the front of the card looks like. That's what the back of the card looks like. Um, Bowman briefing with uh, with some uh, some information. Pretty cool cards. Uh, we got Dontrell Willis. Dontrell Willis um, had some some good years. Um, Roy Halladay, Hall of Famer Roy Halladay. Liked Roy Halladay a lot. Passed away way too young in that plane crash. Uh, we got a Tory Hunter. And what do we have here? We got a Road to 500 insert card for A-Rod. That's pretty cool. Uh, there's home run number 163, it looks like, from A-Rod. So, a uh, little uh, insert. Alex Rodriguez, home run number 163 against the Tampa Bay Devil Rays. Pretty cool card. Pretty interesting right there. Okay, we got a gold card of Chase Utley. That's not gonna be numbered, but pretty cool. There. Now we're getting into our chrome cards. There's a first Bowman chrome of Brian Henderson. Ooh, I'd like to see the chrome. And a First Bowman Chrome of Myron Leslie. And then we got a Adam Carr first Bowman card. And Marvin Lawrence or Lawrence. So some pretty cool cards. We'll put uh, those on the side. That's what the Chrome card looks like right there. I've never seen one. Yeah, there you go. Now you have. All right, so we got one, two, three, four, five packs left. Ooh. What's that? That's our special surprise at the end. They guarantee you hits. So we'll open that up at the end. There's going to be something good in there. Um, let's open up our Diamond Kings pack. Is there any that I need to put in one of those folder things? 
Uh, not yet. I'm pretty happy she told me to put one in earlier. Yeah, I want, if you could put actually put these two in penny sleeves. Okay. Those are these. Okay. We'll get a couple of these sleeved up just for safekeeping. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's take a look at this. This is our 2019 Diamond Kings. Diamond King cards, pretty cool. I like the Diamond King sets. Uh, see if there's any hits in here. We got a uh, Luis Severino, Yankees pitcher. Yes. Thank you. There's yes. Dave Winfield sleeved up for my cousin. We got a Grover Alexander. What we got here? We got a Masters of the Game insert card. That sounds that it, that that sounds like it's good. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Here's this. Masters of the Game. Here's this one sleeved up. Thank you. And then if you could sleeve that one up, that Masters of the Game card. I don't know if I've ever seen that before. That's pretty cool. We got a Roger Clemens and a Hank Greenberg. So Since it says, like, Master of the Games, you know, it gives that hint of, like, Master of the Games. Like, if he's a Master of Games, yep. here's this. All right. Let's see here. We'll go for our 2020 Big League. I like this set a lot. This was a lower cost set, but some really cool stuff in here. Ooh, this, like the, the, the picture on this box, it looks like it's like a cartoony. Yep, it's Topps Heritage. All right, we got a uh, Christian Yelich, big league Topps product. That's what the back of the cards look like. Uh, like this design a lot. Got a little factoid on the back. Uh, Starling Marte. We got a Nikki Lopez, Brian Anderson. A Jake Rogers rookie card. Got a roll call of Max Scherzer. Kyle Seeger orange parallel. Josh Hader. Dakota Hudson. And a Mike Miner. So nothing too crazy in this pack. Let's move on to our Topps Heritage. Uh, looking for exclusive 1971 Baseball tattoos. I don't know what that is. That sounds, um, that sounds like it's for... It sounds like it has tattoos. Here's the odds for Topps Heritage, if you want to take a look at that. Um, all kinds of different things you could pull from here. Um, let's see what we can find. I like the design of, uh, of Heritage quite a bit. We've got uh, Willie Adamas. Got a Jake Lamb, Jock Peterson. These autographs on the top of the cards are not real. These are facsimile autographs. Um, if it is an autographed card, it's going to be in blue ink. That would be awesome if we could find one. Uh, Jose Osuna, Mike Miner. We got a rookie card of uh, Albert Alzole and Nico Horner. That's a nice one, so we'll get that sleeved up. Nathan, if you could put this in a sleeve for me, that would be great. Okay. Max Muncy and Wilson Contreras. So once my son sleeves up that Nico Horner rookie, we'll put that on the screen. That's a nice card. Oh, and I'm holding this thing. Okay. Down to our final two packs here, and then we'll get into this bonus hits. Um, leave a comment. Let me know what you think and what You're your favorite card is. Nice. Yep. Good and then... Uh, We'll put that right there. All right, let's get into our jumbo pack. This is gonna be pretty cool. 34 cards in this pack, looking for um, you know, all, the, all the big rookies of this year, looking for maybe a relic or an auto card. Who knows what we're gonna find in here. Let's find out. Okay, got a lovely Base or security tag on the back. Uh, looks like there might be something in here. Eh, I don't know. We'll find out. All right. Uh, 2020, nice, clean design for Tops this year. I like the Tops design. Series one, uh, most of the really strong rookies for the year. Uh, David Boat, Chris Archer, Jose Peraza, Kirby Yates. We got an Adalberto Mondesi. We got Jose Urania. Uh, Randy Arizarena, there we go. That's a nice one right there. Um, last I checked, his base card and his Cardinals uniform was going for you know, uh, upwards of 5 to $10, just uh, just raw. So we'll get that sleeved up. That's, that's a nice one. 
Um, my son's taking a break, eating some crackers right now, so I'll get that sleeved up myself. But uh, I think that's gonna be my best part of the of the video so far. Got a Zach Wheeler. Uh, Herman Marquez, Jake Lamb, Ben Gamble, Starling Marte. We got a home run challenge of Reese Hoskins, a decades best Jacob Degrom. That's pretty cool. Um, got a Vladdy Jr. Turkey Red. Got a Jesus Luzardo Turkey Red. That's pretty awesome. We'll get that sleeved up. We got Cole Calhoun, a Jesus Lusardo base card rookie. Uh, Carlos Correa. We got Brian Abreu, Miggy Cabrera, future Hall of Famer. Dan Vogelback, Hun Jin Ryu, Mike Clevenger with his uh, Still at the Indians. We got Billy Hamilton, Hansel Robles, Steven Strasburg, Mitch Hanniger. Got a Juan Soto, Tim Anderson, Christian Vasquez, Blake Tehran, Nick Marcakis, and a Luke Voigt. So, some uh, some decent cards in there. That was a, that was a good pack. Let's just get these Jesus Lasardo cards into sleeves. He's probably uh, I put him in potentially top five, definitely top ten rookies for. 2020 class, getting his turkey red and his base cards pretty cool. So we'll put those up on screen right here. Starting to fill up the screen with our uh, with our cards of interest. Um, this one I was really looking forward to, so we're gonna crack into this and then we will see what's in our mystery surprise here. Last pack is going to be a 2020 Topps Sapphire Edition. Um, these cards are gorgeous. Um, I've seen these online. I have never opened them myself, but um, absolutely beautiful looking cards. Got that really nice sapphire finish. Almost a cracked ice type look. Um, there's Aaron Nala. That's what the back of the cards look like. But uh, these cards are absolutely beautiful. Got an Alex Bregman. Mitch Keller. And Carlos Carrasco, who is now on the Mets. So that's pretty cool. Um, no big hits in there, unfortunately. But um, still, really, really nice looking cards. So... As you can see, we pulled some nice cards so far, that Randy Arizarena being the nicest one. And now we move on to our guaranteed hits. Um, they guarantee you at least two autos or relics or one graded or a graded star or rookie card. So let's open this up and see what we have inside. All right. Okay, let's see. Opening this on up, if I can get it open. Okay, first card up is going to be a Game Gear from Donruss. Uh, that's going to be a 2014 Donruss Game Gear Relic of Brad Ziegler. And look at this from Immaculate. Nice. Um, it's an Adbert Azale. Not the greatest name, but uh, certainly a good, good player. Good rookie. Um, it's going to be an autograph jumbo relic numbered out of 73. So five out of 73 Adbert Azale jumbo relic autograph from Immaculate. So that will do it for our walk-off wax box. Um, ask me for the $39 that they charge. 
a lot of fun, some really nice cards um, with these packs. Sometimes you get the big hit, sometimes you don't. Um, I'm certainly happy with it. Um, got some really nice cards to add to my PC. Love that Arizarania. Um, like I said, the Albert Alzale, not the biggest name, but it's a very nice, look at the size of that patch. Very nice patch uh, with the autograph. So hit that like and subscribe button. Let me know what you think. Um, let me know what your favorite card is. And uh, we'll see you next time with another brand new video. This has been Searching for Hits with Eric and Nathan. And uh, we'll, like, we'll see you next time. Leave, leave a like, subscribe, and click that notification bell to get, notifi get notified for new videos that come out. There you go. Make sure you hit that notifi notification alert button. Have a great weekend, everybody.